Dustin, what's up, man? Uh, welcome to Miami. Thank um, you. I guess uh, what kind of led you to, to sign with Miami? What kind of, can you take us through the process a little bit? Um, <clears throat> yeah, as uh, many people may know, uh, Coach Boyer and uh, Coach Flo, Flores, <laughs> he, uh, they were actually, you know, a part of the New England program. And, um, you know, that kind of helped me, you know, it kind of convinced me to lean towards this way. And, um, you know, not to mention that, you know, I kind of looked at the defense, looked at the offense, looked at the team, and I checked them out. Every, you know, the, the potential, the ability is, you know, extraordinary. I like these guys. I like this team. I like this organization. And, um, you know, it, and also location. You know, it's a great location to be at. <laughs> Joe? Welcome to South Florida. I can assure you this is a great place to live. Um, what? Tell us about uh, your strengths as a player. What are some things that you think you do well? Honestly, when I think of my strengths, I think of, you know, a couple words, you know, relentless, uh, smart, uh, you know, determined, and when I think of relentless, you know, uh, you know, whatever it takes to get the job done, you know, I feel like I'm going to do whatever, whatever it takes and I'm going to give it my all. And, uh, you know, I, I feel like as long as I, you know, pay close attention to details and learn from my teammates and learn from the coaches, you know, I, I can better myself as a player and as a person as well. So, Josh? Yeah, Justin, Josh Tolentino with The Athletic. Welcome to Miami, man. Um, you. you talked about potential. You're, you're joining a team that led the NFL in interceptions last year. What do you think about uh, your group specifically there with, you know, Xavier Howard, Byron Jones, Nick Needham, uh, some of those guys there in that cornerback room? You know, I think that's an extremely talented group and uh, definitely going to raise the level of competition, you know, and uh, – I'm willing to compete for, you know, whatever position it, it turns out to be. And um, that those guys are definitely going to create competition. So, um, you know, I'm, I'm looking forward to playing next to these guys and I'm looking forward to learning from them as well. Adam? Yeah, echoing all my colleagues, welcome to Miami. We're, we're glad to have you. Uh, I'm curious, what, what was 2020 like for you? I know you you, you dealt with COVID for a bit and you had the injury. Uh, it couldn't have been the year you expected. You, you, you eager to get back out there? Man, I, I don't want to really want to talk about, you know, what happened in 2020, but because I'm looking forward to 2021. So, but I can say that I, I'm going to learn from, you know, everything that happened in 2020 and, you know, the injury, whatever was, you know, a, unfortunate but however you know I'm just working to become a better player this year. Steve what was your impression of Brian Flores in New England and what's your impression of the job he's doing in Miami? You know he's always been uh, someone who I thought was an aggressive coach you know who you know feels very confident and what he's doing. And, you know, if he's confident, I'm right along with him. I'm confident with him. So, um, you know, what he have going on here, I'm confident that he will get things done. So. Alan? Uh, hey, Justin, like everybody else, welcome to South Florida. Thank you. So uh, Josh Boyer was your cornerbacks coach when you first got into the NFL. Now he's going to be your DC. What stands out most when you look back at your time working with him? Uh, the fact that he understands, you know, uh, discipline, he understands football. He understands that, you know, no matter how many different schemes that people can come up with, football never changes. And, you know, he can put a lot of players in a, in a relaxed state and what I mean by that is you know he he made me feel comfortable when it comes to certain situations because you know 
he just lets you know that, you know, football doesn't change and he simplify it as much as, you know, he needs to in order to get the player to understand what they need to do. Cam? Hey, Justin, I guess just talking about, you know, I know you don't want to talk about previous years, but I guess watching you in previous years, you seem like you were effective most when you were in the slot. Um, did you did you talk to them about, you know, whether that slot role is a, the, the role you want to compete for or, or what their vision is for you in this defense? Honestly, you know, I came in here with the mindset that I'm going to compete for whatever role it, it is, you know, whatever, you know, they put me at, I feel like I'm going to just give it my all and compete. 